Geronimo van der List is the big fella in the middle for The Hague, who comes from the iconic Netherlands city of Gouda, well known for its tasty cheese. I actually worked in the cheese factory when I was 15 years old. Uh, that was really tough working because you start in the morning, five o'clock in the morning until four o'clock in the afternoon, so it's really hard work. But uh, yeah, I, I can actually tell wherever I lived that I was from Gouda because everybody knew the, the Gouda cheese, so. Having played basketball all over the world, Vanderlis was attracted to 3x3 in hopes the exciting game makes the sport more popular in his soccer mad country. I actually saw the, the European Championship in Amsterdam. That was a really good experience because uh, a lot of people that come from outside that don't have anything to do with basketball, they were interested and that's also a very good thing for basketball, uh, first of all, because basketball is not as popular in Holland. Soccer is very big, you know, and that's when I saw the three on three. I wasn't really ready, ready for it because I was still busy with the five on five. And then this summer they uh, assembled uh, Team The Hague and Team Amsterdam uh, together. They, they changed Team Amsterdam a little bit. We started practicing together and it was a good experience and we got to go on all these, these trips, so that was really, really nice. Practicing with compatriots Amsterdam Enox deals has helped The Hague be more competitive in the World Tour debut season. The advantage of us that we have, because we practice against Team Amsterdam every day, is that they play also very physical and it learns us to deal with it. They scream really good, they have a really good pick and roll. Almost as tall as the Patronus Towers, Vanderlis has an intimidating presence on the court, but is a gentle giant off of it. He runs a camp for underprivileged kids during the summer. I'm actually... Uh having a camp with two of my older teammates. It's a camp for kids in Holland. It's just so cool to work with 100 kids and teach them something that I do twice a day, you know? So uh, it's not only basketball because we try to teach them also the way uh, when you eat together, involve everybody, no bullying and stuff like that, because it happens everywhere, you know? So we added the 3x3 part in our, in our camp. I think it was a good addition to the camp. It's a very uh, a new way of playing basketball and I, the kids really liked it.